I'm Edie Lash and I'm here inside the Hub Culture studio. Delighted to see a friend of Hub from a long time ago, right? That's right. <laughs> William Pfeiffer, Executive Chairman and Founder of Global Gate Entertainment. Tell me first of all, what is Global Gate? Global Gate is a consortium of 14 partners um, that uh, work together to create new local language movies and TV series uh, around the world, in the key markets around the world. We uh, look for intellectual property from various different countries, including our partners who are all top film production and distribution companies. And uh, we uh, produce new movies with them and distribute them for the world. They're mass market, wide release movies. So why local language? In each of these key countries, local language films are growing in their market share. All things being equal, people would rather see their own people mm -hmm. in their films and their TV mm -hmm. shows. And so we look for the best stories around the world and feel that there are universality of themes. Mm -hmm. And we bring stories, whether they be scripts, books, or movies that have been made in other countries already, try to find the best ones. And then with our partners in those uh, key markets uh, in Asia, Europe, and Latin America, well, we make uh, these, these feature films and TV series. Tell me your favorite story that you've told. <laughs> My favorite story that we've told, I'd, I'd have to say, is uh, there's a movie called Instructions Not Included, which is uh, the top Spanish language film of all time that was made by our partners Pantaleon, which is a joint venture with Lionsgate and Televisa. And uh, we've remade that film now in, uh, in, in France, in Brazil, in Turkey, and we're remaking it in uh, India, China, and Korea. Soon we'll be making it in the United States with Lionsgate as well. Okay, and what could be even better? What's the thing that you want to be even better at? Well, I think that uh, creating movies that work in not only the countries for which they are intended in that local language, but to make movies for the global market that reach beyond. Uh, you know, I think with my background in uh, making feature films around the world. We've had success with certain films like Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, which was a Chinese movie, but it also worked in the US and everywhere else. I'd like to make more uh, of the local language movies appeal to the world markets and, and to take series complex concepts that can be made in different languages but tie them all together with one thematic uh, angle uh, that ties uh, stories from different countries and different languages together for a global market. And so how does the digital and how does the mobile phone and how does the speed at which information moves around the world now help or hinder you? I think it helps because people are able to see what they want to watch, where they want to watch, when they want. And uh, convenience is very important for the busy uh, work days of people today. And uh, so I think you know, it also opens up new opportunities to make shorter kinds of content, different kinds of content than the traditional feature film for the big screen or the, uh, or the series that are made generally for televisions. Um, you know, we, we can, uh, I think in many ways, come up with new interactive uh, technologies, whether it be virtual reality, uh, augmented reality, and different ways to tell our stories. So uh, with inexpensive equipment, we're able to tell more stories, and, and I think we're able to tell them better. William, thanks so much for stopping by the Hub Culture <laughs> Studio. We will let you go warm up. Somewhere. Thank you so much. My, <laughs> great, my great pleasure. Thank you.